Hello everybody and welcome to your Maxwell's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this is a reading for the beautiful sign of Taurus. Now my dear friends Taurus, this is your monthly for October reading. So here we go with the predictions in love. Let me remind you. I'm using three different decks, three different types. We are using here some tarot, or we're using some fortune cards, and we're using some Lenormand. So we're going to start off with fortune cards. I would just like to mention that if you have not yet subscribed, please do click onto that subscribe button, onto that like a button to show your support to the channel, and it is always and greatly appreciated. Also, if you do have any questions, you would like to contact me, all my information is right below into the YouTube description box, but you can also reach me every single night from 9 p.m. all the way till midnight. So for three hours straight, Eastern Standard Time, I am here live streaming to answer your tarot questions. Also, um, well, let's begin this reading. Let's go and see here, my dear friends, Taurus, what is going on? So Spirit, please do tell me. I'm going to start off here with the fortune telling cards. Spirit, please do give me those blessings. Give me whatever it is I need to hear. Is it challenges? Is it beautiful blessings? Please, what do we need to know for Taurus in the month of October? I'm going to give, um, I'm going to do both. I'm going to give a brief, um, pr a prelude if you want uh, for singles and then I'm going to also speak about the couples. So both are going to be joined into this reading. So I did take five cards out. Let's see what we have here. We have the Chimera, I have the Key, I have the Harlequin, I also have Medusa and I have the Wizard. Okay, so um, there's Jealousy. There's Jealousy, my dear friends, Taurus. Ooh la la. Okay, so this is about really being careful. Within this relationship, we're going to go and check out in the tarot cards what is going on with this jealousy. There is somebody within the relationship that is hiding something from you. We're speaking here uh, mask feelings with the theater, with the Harlequin. This is about hiding something, hiding behind that mask. We want to know what is hidden behind it. Why are they hiding anything from you? What are they hiding? I'm not going to say that there's a third party or anything of the such. We're going to go and discover it in just a moment, but I do have to say they are definitely jealous. They are de definitely jealous of somebody who is around you right now. Do they want to get this person out of the picture or not? Is left to be seen. I also have here uh, about using your skills. It's really important here to use your beautiful talents during the month of October. When I'm speaking about your talents, I'm speaking about defending yourself. I'm speaking about standing your ground. I'm speaking about Whatever it is that is bothering you or that you think might be toxic within this relationship, it is time for you to, you know, stand your ground and remove whatever is no longer good and keep the beautiful positive with you. So this is about using whatever tools you have at your disposition in order to make things okay with this relationship. Um, I also have over here locked doors can now be opened. Um, so... I believe you are going to be getting over here your answer. Whatever it is that you've been wondering here, there are secrets, what's going on, you're going to find out what it is. You're definitely going to get that clarity. Um, in the meanwhile, it's really important for you though, whenever you do find what is going on, to not let, okay? Before also, don't let that imagination of yours just kind of clear or kind of cloud your judgment. It's very important to try to be as objective as possible within all of this. Now, if you are single, I do have to say that somebody is, is definitely interested in you, okay? Somebody is interested in you, but they're not quite moving on forward yet. Um, but they feel there is somebody else who is around you, and I have to say they are quite jealous of this person. They would just love to be able, as soon as possible, to get closer to you um, in order to you know, to kind of remove that menace if you want. They don't want that other person to be into a relationship with you before they get to be in a relationship with you because they truly want, you know, they want you for them and they don't want you to be with somebody else. So singles, somebody is around you, somebody is interested and somebody is really jealous. Um, the couple, couple, there's jealousy there also, but the jealousy is hiding something else. So let's go and try and find out what's going on. What is hidden? What is hidden with that jealousy when that mask. What is going on? Why are we hiding things like that? Spirit, please do reveal to me. Give me some clarification on Taurus. What is happening with Taurus love in October? Please, clarifications on the feelings are masked and jealousy leads to downfall. Please. 
Hey, Ten of Pentacles, I'm not having a happy ending here, my beautiful um, souls. I have the Empress. I have the King of Wands. I have somebody who is walking away. If you are if you are into a couple here, um, I have to say this is all about danger, okay? I feel like this is truly going to be somewhat of a downfall. Whatever it is you're going to discover, I feel like there might be. Whatever news you are getting here is going to lead to the downfall of this relationship. Now, energies do change and you know whatever you do can change the outcome so I do want to make that really clear I'm not saying it's going to end definitely but for some of you if you're not able to rectify this situation I feel like whatever news you are getting is so powerful that or just not not acceptable for you that it, it is going to end I do have some unhappy endings over here. Um, I do have both partners looking in complete different directions over here. So you're both looking in different ways as if you're as if you're already thinking of something else. I have the strength. Strength is into a reverse position. Our strength over here has no more strength. Our strength is weak. And look at what we're doing. We're walking away is what we're doing with the Eight of Cups. We're walking away from this relationship. We're walking away maybe from the situation. Maybe from the situation to return stronger. That is a possibility. But right now, I'm going to say by the end of the month of October, somebody is walking away. Let's go see with the Lenormand. Lenormand, please give me some... Give me some information. Give me some clarity on what is going on for Taurus. Please, Taurus... What message do you have for Taurus spirit, please? What message? Okay, so we have those endings that were not quite what we wanted. We have somebody who's pretending to be innocent, which is coming back to our Harlequin over here with wearing that mask and the deceit that we had over here. We have over here the owls. Whoops, and the owls is all about opening your eyes really, really big because what do owls do, right? They sleep in the day, but they're awake at night. At night, you need to watch. Something is going on at night. You need to open your eyes really, really clear. That's where you're going to get your your hint about what is going on. So please do, uh, you know, keep your eyes wide open. Keep your heart wide open also. Let's not block anything. Clarity is coming your way. But I do have to say, unless something changes in here, somebody is definitely, you know, hiding, lying. And this situation over here is not looking like it's going to end into a way that you desire, into a way that you wish. It seems to be ending into a decision. So I believe that by the end of October, if you are into a couple, my dear friends, Taurus, this is about decision time. It's it's really big. This is decisions. What are you going to do? What are you going to decide? This love, the love is still there. I have to say there's still love even though there is something that is going on here, even though we, we want to go away, even though we have that frustration. We have some lies. We have some lies because we still love and we don't want to say what is going on. This is why if we did not love anymore, we would say right away and everything would be out into the clear. So you need to know that the love is there. So whenever you do make this decision, Please know that if you do love your partner and your partner loves you, there is always a chance to close one of those doors and just make it a one-way road. So this, my dear friends, Taurus, does complete your October reading. Um, if you have any questions, any personal questions, you would like to come and join me into a live, please do so. 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, all the way till midnight every night. Please don't forget to click the subscribe button, the like button. Have yourself the most beautiful day. I thank you for being there, and I will see you later on into the live or tomorrow. Have a great day.